Hi everyone and welcome to my doll channel. So this past Thursday, I was sitting around bored. I mean, what do you do on Thursday? There's no no flea markets open and there's no garage sales and but there's antique stores, right? Well, my dad he was gone on a date. Yep, 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 yep. A twelve-hour date. Let me tell you. Anyway, so John's like, well, let's go to some antique stores. I said, yes, let's go terrorize some antique. I mean, let's go. Look at some antique stores. But anyway, you can have fun in the antique stores. I'm going to have a little fun. And I'm going to show you little dolls. And the very last place I went to, I found this. And yes, there was something in it. Um, Something that I hadn't, didn't even know existed. But it's a vintage doll with lots of outfits. So stay to the end. And I'm going to show you. And so pretty. And it was more like a thrift store than an antique store. So I didn't have to give so much for it. Not as much. And, you know, John, he's like, oh, early birthday present. He likes to get me presents for my birthday all year long. So, uh, he's so sweet. So, let's let's get going with the video. Thanks, Becky. Let's try this antique store. Hey, pretty birdie. Hey, pretty birdie. Hey, pretty birdie. Oh wow, I would love to have this Barbie piano. It's made in 1981, isn't it? Oh, it's so pretty. But I'm in an antique store. So, guess what you think it's worth. And then I'm going to show you what they want for it. $80 for her. <laughs> I, I might would give uh, uh, 10, 15, maybe. Oh, Lord and mercy. What else they got? There's Lucy and Desi. Let's see the shocking price of this one. One fifty. We're in an antique store today. Look who's coming to greet me. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. And yes, I bought them. Samantha doll, bewitch. Well, she's 45. And I never heard of this fan girl. 40, 45. Oh, I love these old timey orange bar stools. Just scan real quick right here. I, lo I love Lucy, baby. Little Debbie Barbie. It's a little dog called Whoopsie. These old timey figurines are adorable. There's a little head base, head base here. Yeah. I did collect these, but uh, I don't want any more right now. I got plenty. Seems like the baby dolls are reasonable. She's eight, but. Um, it's nothing special that, I, that I'm looking for, so I'm going to pass. Here's a Rapunzel. I love the Rapunzel. I love the Rapunzel doll. Oh, these are just little beanie babies. They're cute. What's down here? Prince. Mm, not much. I like this basket though. It's a sewing basket. Here's a big old Elvis doll. And an Abraham Lincoln doll. Didn't know it's an Abraham Lincoln doll. Did you? Ah. Oh, I'm so 
so tired. I think I'll take a nap. There's a bed for me and for Barbie. Hmm. Hope they don't catch me. Yeah, that is exactly how you snore. Oh, I, I just love this pink and white furniture. If I ever made an all pink room, this would definitely be in it. How about you? Do you love this? So let's see what's in this trunk. And this is a big one. I've got, let me get it open here. You know, it's a nice trunk so I can keep my doll in it. Ah, paper's fun everywhere. So here she is. And then, and there's lots of accessories with this doll. And she don't look like she's ever been played with. She's Oh, she's just a fine. She is a treasure to me. This is a candy by Deluxe Reading Company. And this is an outfit that she's got. Kind of show her up close. Look at her. She has a pair of glasses and she has earrings. And these dolls, they don't turn, they don't turn green with their earrings like Barbies do. Look at her little glasses. And she's got, let's take this off because I'm going to show you all her outfits and I'll switch her out real quick so you don't have to be bored while I'm switching them. But look at, she's got joints. Now, uh, Deluxe Reading made a lot of dolls. And this is one she's got. So she's got this bend in her knee so she's posable and this bend in her elbow. Don't want to, she's so old, I don't want to force anything but she's got this little bed you can sit right there and isn't this an adorable dress but this is not even the prettiest one this is the one she had on so let's see what other outfits she had this part of the skirt comes off and I guess this could be a swimsuit for her this would be appropriate for the time era a swimsuit like this I love old style swimsuit so Here's her cute little black shoes. They would go give my outfit today, but I'm barefooted. So yes, this would definitely be a swimsuit because this is why she had the glasses and the straw hat that's purple and blue that matches her swimsuit. Isn't she adorable? I just love this doll. Now this one is, they're not marked. Oh, Deluxe reader. There's just some numbers on the back of her head, but I, I like I said, I did look her up and she's close up of her pretty little face. Kind of reminds you of the Madame Alexander uh, CC doll, but this one is by Deluxe Reader, and she's just fabulous. And I'm so glad to add her to my collection of vintage dolls. She's so big, I had to stand up. To, to get everything in focus here. But this is one of the dresses. This is her elegant dress with all these little sparkle studs. And there's even one at each sleeve right here. And of course it snaps in the back. There is uh, the built-in slip or two slips like the a crinoline type slip, which is like the knitting. It really makes them a little stiffer and stand out a little more. And then one so it's not see through and I think the only accessories that she was missing here's her pink shoes is I looked her up and found that she did come with jewelry like beads but she didn't have the beads but everything else, oh, I guess these don't pop like the Barbies I'm always oh, there's a wrap that goes with it isn't that cute? And, and even her purse. And her purse has the same little studs on it. And so let's look at the next one. So this is her next dress with that, I don't know what style collar you call this, but it falls down in the back and snaps. It's a green material. It's a really thick cloth, uh, probably all cotton. And this is double layered, so there's a complete white in her shoes that go with this one. I don't remember which her which purse goes with this. Oh uh, I don't know. So let's get her shoes on her. So 
So there she is with her shoes. And I know that this little green hat has to go with her. Look at the way this is made. It kind of sits up there on her head. Kind of looks like that airline stewardess look, but I'm, I don't know. This is a little black purse. It wouldn't go with that one. So maybe it goes with this one. So she's got the black purse. And it's plastic. Let's see if it opens. And it opens. That'd be a good place to keep her jewelry if she had the jewelry. But she don't have the, the necklaces. Next. This out, next outfit came in three pieces. Here's her silk top. And it's, it's a blue. Two pieces. And then here's her jacket. She has a little jacket that goes with this. And this is what the three piece looks like. What color shoes you think came with this? Red. So she's got her. She's got her red shoes. They just really, they really pop on. So these shoes stay on good. They are not going to fall off. They just, they're tight, but they don't split. Perfect fit. And she's got a purse. It's red, so, and it's a little, it's big and it's plastic. And see, she could put stuff in that. That's so cute. Right on the head. Keep her arm up. I guess she could hold it like that. Don't step. And one more piece that goes with her. And that is, look at this strange little hat. It's, uh, I don't know which way it goes. It's, uh, and there goes her purse. Dolls just don't want to hold on to things. I guess they just kind of fit up there. You could put a safety pin or something in them. Um, with that ribbon on top of it. And there she is in this outfit. Let me get her purse back on her. So there she is in this outfit. So this is everything that I got with her shoes. And the stands and she actually stands on her own she's not a, on a stand and she she can balance and she stands up i think that's so cool <laughs> oh my goodness 150 dollars for a toilet paper holder <laughs>